Imagine a circle. Now, imagine this circle is perfectly centered at the heart of a coordinate plane where the x-axis and y-axis intersect. This is the unit circle. This special circle has a radius of 1, which simplifies many trigonometric calculations. The unit circle is more than just a shape. It is a powerful tool for understanding angles and their corresponding trigonometric values. The unit circle allows us to visualize the relationship between angles and their trigonometric functions. Each point on the circumference of the unit circle corresponds to a specific angle. This angle is measured from the positive x-axis, rotating counterclockwise. Each point on the unit circle has coordinates, x, y. These coordinates are not random. They hold special significance in trigonometry. The x coordinate of a point on the unit circle represents the cosine of the corresponding angle. The y coordinate represents the sine of the angle. Let's consider a few examples. The angle, 0 degrees or 0 radians, intersects the unit circle at the point 1, 0. Therefore, cos 0 equals 1 and sin 0 equals 0. Similarly, the angle 90 degrees or P2 radians corresponds to the point 0, 1 on the unit circle. This means QoS, P2 equals 0 and sin, P2 equals 1. As we move counterclockwise around the unit circle, we encounter other common angles such as 45 degrees, P4 radians, 60 degrees, P3 radians, and 180 degrees, Pi radians. By understanding the coordinates of these points, we can easily determine the sine and cosine values for these angles. The unit circle is not just limited to sine and cosine, we can also use it to understand other trigonometric functions, such as tangent, cotangent, secant and cosecant. These functions can be derived from the sine and cosine values. For example, the tangent of an angle is defined as the ratio of the sine to the cosine tan equals synth divided by cos. Using the coordinates of the point on the unit circle corresponding to angle theta, we can calculate the tangent of that angle. Similarly, the reciprocal trigonometric functions can be determined. Cotangent is the reciprocal of tangent, secant is the reciprocal of cosine, and cosecant is the reciprocal of sine. The unit circle provides a visual and conceptual framework for understanding the relationships between all of these trigonometric functions. Section 4. Finding Secondary Solutions Trigonometric functions are periodic, meaning their values repeat in a cyclical pattern. This periodicity is evident when we consider angles on the unit circle. For example, an angle of 30 degrees and an angle of 390 degrees both correspond to the same point on the unit circle. This property of periodicity means that trigonometric equations can have multiple solutions. The unit circle helps us visualize and find these secondary solutions. If we know one solution to a trigonometric equation, we can use the symmetry of the unit circle to find other angles that satisfy the equation. For example, if we are looking for angles where the sine A function equals one half, we can start by finding the primary solution, which is 30 degrees or P6 radians. Using the symmetry of the unit circle, we can see that an angle of 150 degrees or 5P6 radians also has a sine E value of one half. We can continue adding or subtracting multiples of 360 degrees or 2P radians to find all possible solutions. Section 5, the unit circle and beyond. The unit circle is a fundamental concept in trigonometry and its applications extend far beyond basic trigonometric calculations. Understanding the unit circle is crucial for working with complex numbers, polar coordinates and trigonometric identities. In more advanced mathematics, the unit circle forms the basis for understanding concepts like Euler's formula, which connects trigonometry to complex exponentials. The unit circle provides a visual representation of these complex relationships, making them easier to comprehend. Whether you are solving basic trigonometric equations or exploring the depths of advanced calculus, the unit circle remains a valuable tool for understanding the interconnectedness of mathematics. Section 6. Conclusion. The unit circle is a powerful tool for understanding angles, trigonometric functions and their relationships. By visualizing angles on the unit circle, we can easily determine their sine and cosine values, as well as the values of other trigonometric functions. 
The unit circle also helps us understand the periodic nature of trigonometric functions and find secondary solutions to trigonometric equations. Its applications extend beyond basic trigonometry, forming the foundation for understanding more advanced mathematical concepts. Mastering the unit circle is essential for anyone studying trigonometry and beyond. By understanding its properties and applications, we unlock a deeper understanding of the interconnectedness of mathematics and its beauty.